Thank you so much for coming back to the East Circuit. Thank you for having now, me was, again. Yes, you're yeah. welcome. This is your home. We're the guests here. Yeah? Thank you. I like to say that because it is, in fact, true. This is Agola. You can find her everywhere. Agola underscore KE. That was her first track, the acoustic yeah. version of Milele of her debut track, Milele. You can find it yeah. everywhere. And a YouTube subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. But yeah. look on a new one, drowning. Yeah, we're going to we're one. going to get into it. But uh, first of all, let's catch up for mm -hmm. a minute. Okay. The last time you were here, it was last year. You were talking with Christine yeah. Kiai. Mm -hmm. um, but ever since then, a lot has been happening, right? Yeah, a lot, a lot. Fill us in. <laughs> wow, it's been a crazy year. Mm. I was hoping, actually, I was hoping to release Drowning way sooner. Okay, but. Obligations. Oh, tell you. <laughs> <laughs> a lot has happened. I was hoping things would go right with it much earlier, but you know. But I can't, not that I'm complaining. Mm. You know, when things are not going your way, sometimes you think, why is this not happening? Mm. Why is God being unfair? But yeah. no, it's all about God's timing, and I just decided, you know, delay is not denial. So, yeah. yeah. 
So you feel like uh, the delay was in fact preparing you for whatever is exactly. going on? Because a lot is going on, you, yeah. you know, you're still working on your music mm -hmm. and you're getting better at the acoustic thing. And of course <laughs> there's the Misty, Mr. Easy thing. Okay, let us know about that first of all, because uh, it's mm -hmm. about 11 people who have been chosen from Kenya. Yeah, it's a really big deal. Yeah. It started out on social media. Yeah. What they were doing is Empower Africa was looking for artists mm. that they can fund for shooting a music video. They were looking for 100 artists. All mm. you had to do was upload yourself, doing your thing, and then choose from there. So. I How does it feel, <laughs> as in it out of all these human yeah. beings in Kenya, all these artists, vocalists Crazy. that you you know you know? Of. Yeah. Fun fact: actually, the last time she was here with Christian Kiai, you mentioned Karun as one of your inspirations, exactly. and now you're on the same level because she's also been chosen, and you're part of that team. Yeah. It's such How amazing a, is that? It's so amazing, it's so humbling. I remember just praying to God, like, please just give me this, and there it was. And there it is. I'm just so grateful. But a lot, a, a lot of good things have been happening for you. Mm -hmm. You are on billboards for the Blaze thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> are you, have you accepted that you're now a superstar? I'm about to just sink in. Uh, you know, when you <laughs> get that mentality, <laughs> mm. I don't like getting that superstar mentality. Mm. I just love to keep myself down to earth so that it can keep me hungry. Because mm. you know when you tell yourself Mifika you won't have the urge to do more. So no, I still have a long so way. So you're still very hungry. Still have a long way to go, exactly. Mm. Yeah. There's something I wanted to ask you. Mm. Now you used to model as well. Oh yeah. Are you still going to do that now that the music thing has really worked out? Yeah, I still do. I still do. By the out there, if you have a a runway show, whatever, book me, I'm so available. You're still available to yeah, do that. Exactly. That's nice. Yeah. Uh, so you're going to mix all of it? Yeah. Because, you know, with the Blaze thing, they were m more or less introducing you like a guitarist, mm -hmm. not, you know, the musician or the vocalist. Mm -hmm. So um, how are you going to, you know, blend all of it? Uh, I just love to challenge myself. I'll mm. do everything that I can grasp, you know. So I'll just do everything I can from the guitar, from singing to songwriting. Actually, fun fact, mm. songwriting to me is something I discovered I could do very recently. Mm. I discovered I could sing way back when I was a kid, but writing, that I just started on in 2016, actually. Mm. Yeah. How did you so discover it? W was it Milele? Uh, because Milele was my first song. That, that was the first song you wrote. Song wrote. Now, uh, mm -hmm. on an earlier interview with Christian mm -hmm. Kier, you said yeah. Milele was about a crush. Yeah, it was. And a very specific <laughs> crush, to be in fact. Yeah. yeah? yeah. Now True. this crush, mm -hmm. I'm scared Milele. Yeah. I saw drowning in the middle I'm only part time and the on a drown. Ama, what's going on, you know, in your personal life? Uh, did you yeah. finally catch up with them? Actually, it's intentional how I've released them. I'm feeling know, like it is. Because yeah. <laughs> you moved from a crush and then you moved and to now the you're next drowning level, in. And now you're drowning in love. Exactly so it worked out. It did you tell him that um, it was about him? It worked out, but not with him. Ooh, not with him. the plot thickens. <laughs> 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 yeah, not with him, unfortunately. Anyway, mm. uh, you know, things, there are things that work out, some that don't. Mm. So you just accept that and move on. Life has to move. So, so Agola, in fact, does have a mm -hmm. significant other in her mm. life. You know something about my songs? Mm. You know, when people think, uh, when people see you've released a song, mm. they think it's about your current situation. Mine are from my past experiences. Mm. Even drowning. Mm. Yeah, it's something from... It's not with the recent one? It's not with the recent one. <laughs> <laughs> He's only hearing this. Unachoma, <laughs> 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 Mike. Huh? Unachoma. Unachoma. Anyway, yeah, it's not a recent thing. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's all I can say. That's all you can say about that. Mm -hmm. But that's nice. That's nice. Uh, we, I feel like we, we already got some hint hints. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> since we already know it's not the first one, now it's the second. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so pigs on my sub will carry one over. I know. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice. So uh, the songwriting part, mm -hmm. on the gonna dig through your personal experiences, yes, yeah. but not necessarily your current situations. Yeah, not necessarily. No. Now drowning. Mm -hmm. What is it about? Who drowning, is it about? Drowning was about this guy. This guy used to date. That used to 
really treat me well. He was a he was a good guy. Mm. Unfortunately, things just got complicated and it didn't work out. That's why I'm not. That's why I'm saying it's not my current situation. We already broke up, but I have to appreciate that he taught me how it feels like to be truly loved. Oh wait, it didn't work out, but you felt loved at the same time. Yeah, as in during the before things got complicated, mm. it worked for some quite um, quite some time. Yeah. When you were feeling like you were drowning. Yeah, that time I was drowning in love. Things were mm. going so well. Everyone had that moment. Yeah. At a car, the relationship ended badly. There was just a moment where you, two, the two of you were clicking and things were going well. Mm. So that's the moment I chose. What I'm doing is I'm choosing to focus on the good. The good yeah, out of that, that came situation. Out of exactly. Nice. Yeah. And now the songwriting. Mm -hmm. Have you written for anyone else since 2016? Um, um, I'm trying to, I really want to. Actually, it's something I'm really trying to do this year, to write for other people. Because mm. I find it interesting. You know, sometimes when you write, you write and you're like, this song is dope, but, but it's not for, for me you. to sing, you know. It mm. won't go well with my voice or something like that, or it's not really your vibe. Mm. So I want to write and give it to people. Mm. Like this, this one song I wrote, I was just feeling like it. Give warm. us a preview. <laughs> Uh, I can't remember it right now. I wrote it a while back, mm. but I feel I feel it was for. Remember, I don't know if you remember to fight for Linda. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that old school R and B vibe. Yeah, if they're out there, please, I have a song for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wrote it and I just felt it's their vibe. So, mm. yeah. Nice, nice. Mm. Uh, I think they're still there. Yeah. That it's the the ones who do covers, yeah. Yeah. Um, covers of yeah. like uh, SWV exactly. and all that. I think we've had them here before. Actually, I've been, yeah. Now this song I wrote. Okay, it's not originally mine. It's yeah. a cover, but I rewrote it in Swahili. Okay. Yeah. It's so. Okay, I can't remember right now. What's wrong with me? <laughs> 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 but I just remember it's an older and this song, mm. and I rewrote it in Swahili, so I just felt, hey, this is for them. It's for them, Kamisa. Ah, yeah. Linda, 254 Linda, I was scared there's a hit song waiting for you. Just go to mm -hmm. Agola underscore KE everywhere. Exactly. 2019, mm -hmm. it's already started on a high note. There's the Empower thing with Mr. Easy. There's uh, Drowning, your second single, uh, yeah. plus the video that we're about to show mm -hmm. on the East Circuit. What mm -hmm. else is in store for Agola? More music, hopefully an album. I am really trying to get an album out before the end of the year. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Who's going condition. to work on the album? Like, uh, uh, do you have any producers in mind? And do you uh, have any collabs in mind? Ah, uh, definitely. Collabs are a must. Because mm. I feel like sharing ideas gets you out of your comfort zone and you're ready to explore what else you can do. Mm. So I'm really open to that. Like and who? Uh -huh. Give us names. The deets. Names. <laughs> <laughs> names, names. Oh, I can't give you names. You right have to. I have to. Yes. No, I don't have to. <laughs> we'll give her a challenge. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I'm really looking forward to working with fellow upcoming artists. Yeah, and the big names as well if they're into a collabo PR. Yeah, come through, come through. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so it's an open invitation. Even a uh, DJ Little Russian can come through and mix, like, hey, you know. Of course. Do you have a hyper song and it's a to have a chick 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 chick? Yes, yeah. we can definitely work See, on that. Yeah, it can be a vibe, yeah. Exactly. Mixing the acoustic with the... The beats and just produce it. Yeah, it'll be a vibe. It'll be a then nice one. you can vibe. come and dance. He's an Isikuti dancer. See, you're already hooking up with... <laughs> you're hooking me up with collabs already, Asante. <laughs> okay, so, Ngoja. <laughs> dancers like Mike can <laughs> No. Oh, really? We don't want a trauma. Me had, wait, wait, did I do something? Remember I last think week? I drank her coffee. No, I don't remember last week's challenge. And I was like, I'll get you. The Lingala challenge. Mm, like, anyway, Lingala. It's all right. It's all right. <laughs> now, here's the thing. In the morning, we were having an interesting discussion. Yes, there's been a few tragic things happening. But I think there's lessons to be learned. And we felt like we needed to ask this question. So the question was, uh, when you're dating, is it right to take gifts or accept them when you're not really interested in this person? Gifts. As a woman, how do you feel mm. about that? For me, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like it's important to be genuine. Mm. What I've learned is, mm. 
So just be upfront from the beginning, mm -hmm. before it gets to anything. Just be serious and just tell them upfront mm. if you see a future with them or not. Yeah, just be genuine. Mm. Nice. Olona, this is what I'm telling you. Oh, is the answer you wanted? The, yes. Ah. This is what <laughs> we need. <laughs> Ladies, I'm telling you, <laughs> listen <laughs> to Agola. Zana na kina migration na utakutu panisha. Really? I gave a straight answer. No, you're on the fence on it. Yes, you're like, so maybe take the gifts, uh, but maybe not. No, 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 no. <laughs> I conquered with Eve when she said that Apple mm. will blame, um, what did she say? What were her words? That Apple it's not fair mm. for a chick to take the gifts or for mm. the guy to like keep insisting you see okay that kind of thing yeah so, so i'm not saying that he, you know it's just mm. the women to blame yes yeah. kuna ma boy, ma kuna ma boy. Yeah. boy children atseni kutuangusha tutasema kwa nyakonde el presidente yeah uh. <laughs> <laughs> so, sana we're about to Actually, I want to do this. I want you to give us an acoustic cover, first of all, mm -hmm. of Drowning, because okay. the way you play the guitar is just phenomenal. Mm -hmm. Then after that, we're going to see the video. Then uh, we're going to sample some of those answers on Y254 channel and the ESA kit on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Miske, the question is, is it right to accept gifts when you're not really interested? So yet again, this is Agola. Just hold up, hold up, baby. Yeah. yeah. You drive me insane. You do, you do. Yeah, yeah. The way you rock your body, you know you drive me insane. The way you look at me, boy, when you find your knees on me, I can't let my I am need a kid that I Yeah, yeah, you got me. Oh, under. Oh, I can't breathe. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Drowning deep in your loving, no, I ain't minding. Yeah, you got me drowning deep in your loving, no, I ain't minding. Yeah, you got me drowning deep in your loving, but I ain't minding. No, I ain't minding. No, I ain't minding. Minding, minding, no. No, I ain't minding. Minding, minding, no. Junesi akinya kasa hit kali pasi akang ikaru kere ikaru kere ikaru kere amina eo gido amina eo amina eo gido amina eo oh ane. Drowning 